Hey, it's Coolio if you don't know, and it is time for some more of the extra long run where we are playing Xenoblade Chronicles 3. So last time we liberated Colony 30, and uh, we figured out, hey, we can probably actually make a bit of a business in liberating these colonies. So what say we go back and liberate Colony 9, where we started the game? The problem is, the more we liberate colonies for a faction, whether it's uh, Keves or Agnes, that faction will start becoming more active in the field and try to stop the thing that we're doing. So that's fun. I mean, that's not going to stop us from continuing on our journey to get rid of all these flame clocks because uh, they are kind of an issue and also are a lot of the reason why we've been why, why we have our whole 10 year lifespan and are required to be fighting all the time um so, yeah, I'm gonna start out this time. I'll have a thing. Might as well, yeah? Y you want me to leave? <laughs> well, why not? Um, what class are you? Every day's a training day. You are currently a heel. Maybe I don't want to have you in the lead. <laughs> Because healing makes me nervous. Uh, I think I might just go Noah. All under control. <laughs> uh, the the bounce back on the stick is kind of rad sometimes. Um. So rather than run all the way there, because that would be a hell of a run. So this is Colony 4. It's the Wall of the Great Hand. And Colony 9 is past this map edge. Um... Oh no, is past this map edge. All right, so now that we're back in Asia region here, uh, I'm gonna press the wrong button. So Colony 9 is all the way Okay, this is where the quest marker leads us. And Actual Colony 9 is here. And of course it won't let us skip travel past this probably. So our best bet is to go to this for post camp. <clears throat> Which I think is where the, the first Napon Trader is. Ooh. There's so many more of them before. Interesting. Yeah, looking for someone, namely probably so us. But yeah, this is where it comes into play that like the farther uh, the further we get into the game, uh the more stuff that we get to learn about. It's all making sense. 
So it's actually going to be kind of beneficial for us to come back to any populated area. But most of the stuff here is just not going to care about us. They're like level 8, level 6, lower than that. So they would rather just not deal with us. It, it sure is, and we're not going to bother it as long as it doesn't bother us. I think in most cases we're not going to need to really <clears throat> worry about most of what's around here. Well, maybe we'll have to worry a little bit. These guys are actually kind of on our level. There's also a level 21 unique there. Uh, remind me of exactly what level we are. 22. Hmm. Well, we have three healers since Valdi is on our team. I say let's give it a try. See what happens. Also, there's this ether channel. The containers feel out of that. Alright, buddy. That's a weird one. Come on over here. I'll lure them in. Ooh, that's a big hit. Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button, okay. Man, it's been a week since I've played, so... But yeah, we're kind of eating crap here. Even with our three healers. We ain't doing great. Valdi is down. We also have ads, so we're gonna need to deal with these guys. Targeting, okay. It's still one eye, let's deal with you. And now we have another one. Alright. Let's deal with this last ad and hopefully there won't be any more. I'm not seeing anything, anything else around here. Um, and after that we can just chain attack on the big guy. Let's do it. Actually, uh, group heals would be very beneficial right now. Thank you, Valdi. Um, what is my current facing? Tell me that, game.
Alright, let's get those heals out. Attack up, let's go. Very nice, got 60 out of that. I'm probably not facing the right way for a break, which that's not great. The one thing that I don't quite get is that, like, there there is a thing for... There, there is, like, a stat in these chain attacks for Ouroboros commands. And I'm not really sure how that comes into play. Oh, we're not going to get another one off, but uh, we're going to reactivate and get one last attack at least. And it's going to be a big one, actually. You know what? You don't need to be here with that name. Ugh, two of my healers are down. It's not great. Oh, my intro link is full. Let's do that. Unfortunate. Ooh, this is rough.
Hmm. Could be another thing with that. I'm almost done now. So in this tiny little spot in the Venn diagram that has all three. That was a rough one. Also, let me just double check something real quick. Materia Crabber. Let's check out what the situation is at Colony 9. yourself to emotion. Some special forces you are. You shut your trap! What a joke! You consider me the joke, do you? Really now? Hey, isn't he? Yeah. He's our friend. From Colony 9. That's where you're wrong. You're traitors. You're no friends of mine. Yeah. Zeon, just listen! We don't want to- Drop it, you. Negotiation doesn't appear to be on the table. Mimi! <sighs> Arrest the turncoats! So we have to fight. Lovely. Alright. Well, we're kind of used to this at this point. Let's uh let's target down one of the ads here. Oh, I'm targeting the one on the back, alright. I wasn't entirely sure. Now I feel bad for burning my gaze. Alright. Let's get the other eye now. Here's this guy. Oh crap! Yeah. 
Oh, it's because there were three of them. Like three and the uh... Okay, that takes care of it. Now I just need to deal with Zia. And actually, I have a chain attack ready, so let's just use that. Um, uh, can't tell the. Okay, that was rear facing, so. Front and side moves are not particularly useful. That is a side facing guy, solidly. At least it looked like it. Um, I. Let's go. It's such a silly statement. I use my thinking muscles for this one. Starting at 80. This is not side facing, but let's just do this. Wow. Give me 80 points, sure. Alright. There's a in non-zero chance that I'm just gonna top out the bar on the first go. Um, I supposed to be facing this way though, so front blowdown seems to be the thing to do. Yeah, there we go. Single attack. Max it out. Boom. Unfortunately, the chain attack bar is different. Oh, yeah. Oh, really? Alright, well, that's intro link then. I was going to do a little bit of a combo, but I kind of lost my entire bars there, so... Because you started it. Commander, please respond. What's wrong? Enemy attack. Active forces. Wonder what's going on. <sighs> Commander? Yes. I'm thinking. Hey, what did you just say? Zeon's the commander now. Does that mean the old one 
There was a change of command. Someone had to take the fall for the traitors. They even dropped our colony rank. We've been so pressed for food we had to venture out this far. All because of you. Well, crap. Go back! We'll take care of things here. I can't allow that. Just get going already! The Agnian Battalion. They're using terrain to cover their approach, am I right? How do you know that? I'm well aware that you don't trust me, I'm just speaking aloud here. We'll intercept the enemy troops, engage them while they're still advancing. They won't get their hands on the colony. You retreat and shore up your defenses. What are you really after here? Why is it you're fighting? We're both in very different positions now. But that doesn't have to mean everything's changed between us. Oh, well done. A voice of reason. Come off it. Wait. Change of plans. We're bringing them back to the colony. What? Why? You're handing them into the consul. No. I'm integrating them into our force as the vanguard. We're fighting with them. Mwamba died because of them. We're up against a whole battalion. Hardly the time for us to be picky. It's also possible that Ouroboros have instigated this attack themselves. Ugh, you can't be serious. You know exactly how serious I am. Fire and sparks. Hold up. Let's do as he says. What? Why should we? Just play along. We'll be better able to help protect Colony 9 if we're part of the plan. Lance? <laughs> if you say so. You have good friends. One day I'm gonna crack that thick bonce of yours and really see what makes you tick. I look forward to it. You lot head back and update Kite on the situation. I'll see to these ones. Meet me in command. As you say. <sighs> you said not everything's changed between us. Your words no longer have merit. So let's judge where your allegiance lies by way of your actions. I understand. We won't let you down. Zion is temporarily joined? Really? You're joining us? There are eight people in this party. I think. Oh, you take you've taken on the hero slot, so Valdi isn't in the party right now. So wait, how can I pick Okay. We should Going probably eat something. Heroes. I gotcha. So I can't pick. Uh, I can't pick Ethel right now because she is uh, not available. Uh, I can technically pick Valdi, but it seems like I'm currently locked into Zion. Going on over there. Don't try to stop us. We can do it. No doubt about it. Okay, this is not going to be a particularly hard fight, but uh, I feel like helping the Kavasi forces right now, since we're in Kavasi territory is what we need to do. Also, we would not have been able to assist the the Crank Crustics anyway. Someone say something? Okay. Ooh. Give me that ether. An ether channel. Let's stock up. You can never go wrong with some ether.
Another three canisters full. Alright. I mean, they weren't really in our way. <laughs> but it seemed like the Kavesi needed a little bit of help with that. gonna be able to just cut through Colony 9. I feel like that's not a particularly good idea at the moment. Let's go around. Oh geez, you're level 23. Alright. Keep thinking maximum voltage is the name of a show on CJDU right now. It's all the voltages. How many people are using giant swing? Am I going to be able to go around? I don't think I am, actually. Music around here. I'm impressed. You didn't run away this time. Uh. I'll explain what comes next. The rest of you are dismissed. Stay cool, Kite. I'm always cool. Tell us about Agnes's movements. Right now. They're assembling their forces on Everblight Plain. They've stopped concealing themselves, which feels like cause for concern enough. They're confident they have the numbers for a full assault, then. Or perhaps it's a feint. Or they're just a bunch of dolts who like pretending they have a plan. <laughs> I'm not in the mood for jokes right now. Hey, we need a little levity sometimes. With enough food, we can draw this out. Give the word, and we can even launch a raid. I told you, that's not going to happen. It would cost us too many lives. What then? Our troops are hungry, anxious, and quite frankly, more pissed off by the hour. 
You leave things like this, and we're going to fall apart by ourselves. We could just remove their reason for fighting you. What? In plain language, please. If we smashed your flame clock, it would alter the equation. If you smashed it? Uh, what? Well, now I know you're all jokers. Kite, biggest joker of all. This is why Kite always runner up in life. No one can take serious with hopeless second best attitude. Damn, Riku laying down. Riku, you, you really know how to hit a man when he's down, don't you? Why are you back here anyhow? How'd you worm your way back into Zeon's favor? Meh. No worming performed. We don't need you here. I've had enough of seeing my friends die. Betray me. I can't deal with this dirt anymore. We feel just the same. Which is why we want to do as much as we possibly can to help. That's why we came back. Yeah. You're not fooling anybody. You need not believe them. But they will prove to be an asset. Huh. So that's it. You're siding with them in the end. You choose Noah over your own lieutenant. Again. That's not what I'm saying. Don't you realize how hard I'm trying here? Ugh! Spot this! Sorry. I didn't mean to complicate matters. On the contrary, was this not your intent? I would have thought you'd be gloating by now. We can gloat if it makes you feel better. But you can't just judge someone in the heat of the moment. Whatever you might think, suspicion will be cast upon you. That is all I can say. Suspicious or not, isn't it about time you tell us this plan of yours? You said we'd prove to be an asset. I'll continue. Though we have a geographical advantage, our provisions and numbers are limited. That's what the enemy will be banking on. And that's where you come in, as the Vanguard. Our sudden appearance will put a spanner in their works, and that'll give you the edge you need, right? Seeing Keves and Agnes Bods fighting together and tearing up their front line's gonna throw them off their game for sure. So we've got to fight independently, then. Better than being on a leash, I suppose. You seem to misunderstand. I'm not cutting you loose. You are still being regarded as traitors. Keep in mind that I shall be supervising your every action personally. Yo. Sir, yes sir, Commander, sir. Do you have to? Let it go, guys. I'll send details of the operation to your Iris. The plan will commence at once. We're on it. So that definitely answers my question of do they recognize us? Yes, they do. But why didn't Ethel recognize us? Like, she has seen us before. I guess she's not as used to us. Time to eat then, huh? Yeah, I don't think we're that welcome into uh, Colony 9 right now. The fact that they didn't jump us is, uh, kind of a miracle, honestly. Can you call it with that? <laughs> I can get these goodies without triggering the uh, bust zone here. Lots of stuff to pick up around here. We're not gonna get those two things, we're just gonna trip the zone. We'll be arriving presently. Uni? 
You okay? Just feeling wistful. This is where we went looking for fortune clovers, isn't it? Oh, yeah. You really made a big deal out of that. Did not. Just wanted to wish upon one. All the others laughed in my face. Said I'd never find one here. Everyone but you guys and Zeon. You must remember, you're not the kind of guy who makes fun of people when they're trying their hardest. You help people in need. <laughs> Listen, I know you've been through all sorts of crap, but you don't know the whole story. Oh, I'm sure. There is no such thing as a traitor who rebels without cause. Be it Kevis or Agnes. You've sent many of my comrades off. No. Time and time again, you saved the dead, helped survivors, even me. I know you do not make light of people's lives. So you understand? I do. But I can never be the friend to you that I once was. You don't give a century, do you? I wasn't talking to you, Lance. Excuse me? Maybe we can't go back to the old days. But we can build something new. Leave your platitudes for after. The battlefield awaits. Don't worry. We'll win. No one's dying on our watch. Never again. Time to move. Stay sharp. All right. Let's keep moving forward. Also, at least, uh, at least you did end up fighting a fortune clover or two. Maybe not around here, but you did. Yes, I know. There's a light skier there. It's also level two. Just as I thought. Wonder what's inside. Couple of on coins. Nothing more complicated than that. Still coming useful. Anything else interesting around here? Doesn't look like it. If you find anything out of the ordinary, I'll issue the order. Right. Those vermin! Yeah, those are our main forces, all right. Huh. Get, get the thing. Huh. There you go. There's anything up here? Huh. Probably not. Hmm. Nope. Oh. Hmm. It's hard to tell when it's going to be worth huh. Huh. taking what looks like a side path. Huh. And discovering something over there. Something so valuable here. Huh. There we go. There's a lot of them. This will be a battle of attrition. We can use the terrain for defensive advantage. First, we need to hurt their morale. Before that, we need to talk. I'll remain here and fight for as long as I stand. That's also part of the plan. It will be a grueling fight. I won't have time to be looking out for possible deserters. Hold on. Are you telling us to find a chance to escape? I never said that. 
But this battle should be of little importance to you. Fuck sake, Zeon. Just how rotten do you think we are? I see where you're coming from. But we're fighting on our own terms. We'll be seeing this through. We owe a debt to Colony 9. Maybe it wasn't for very long, but it gave us somewhere to belong. But not anymore. Just shut it, you. How hard is it for you to accept someone just wants to do a good deed? Hey? Eh? Get a clue! Lance! How often does he need telling not to abandon himself to his feelings? Constantly. Even in. <laughs> Still, might as well strike while the iron's hot. Here we go. That'd be a fight kind of similar to the beginning of the game, I think. I worked before my days, but y'all kind of chained that up real quick. Um, get the medic. So it is just straight up chaining uh, combat here. I love my flower. <laughs> oh boy. Sending the rest of them all at once, huh? Alright. I saw a medic in there. Let's go after them first. Uh, let's go ahead and enter them. Chain attack isn't going to do very much in this case. Because we're up against a lot of targets. But it's not going to be nearly as effective as uh, uh, the stuff is disappearing. Why is it disappearing? kill each other. Pull back now, and we won't pursue you. I'll bet you won't. Because you'll be dead. I mean, if you insist. Let me see. Always keep your ace in reserve. That's how the game's played. Is it? Don't falter. We have Kite and the others holding the fort. 
Yeah. And we'll hold the line here. Whatever it takes. Of course, the problem is that reset the battle, so I have to rebuild my entire chain attack again. <laughs> Take care of the skirmisher. Testudo? Testudo? However you pronounce that. Slow you down for a second. There we go. <coughs> I'm done. Squad leader's been hit! Pull back! Why aren't you following them? As we said, we I wouldn't. told you. I don't want needless slaughter. You're soft, rookie commander. Let me tell you something. You don't win wars while keeping your hands clean. You're gonna learn that. The hard way. You'll see. And he just kind of I guess falls we'll over backward and, de and dies. I wouldn't normally, but in this instance, I'm afraid he struck a chord. I believe I said something similar to you in the past. We were sparring with training swords. You won in the end. I did. Because you always held back. That's not true. <laughs> you hated the very idea of fighting. That's how it seemed to me. And back then, I thought you'd never survive with that lofty idea. I was blind. If we don't stand for something greater, strife and conflict will grow ever fiercer. We would end up fighting not for the flame clock, but for our own bloodlust. That is who we are. It was never going to be easy. Yeah. I'm still trying to figure out what's right myself. But there's something I want to change. And to do that, I have to change myself. <laughs> the kite and the others pull through, okay? It seems we've averted disaster. For now. Not quite. There's still unfinished business. Zion, I want you to understand the things we've seen. The truth about the flame clocks. Just let us explain. After that, we'll let you have the final say. As you wish. It also saves us an awkward silence on the way back. But don't get your hopes up. That's fine. Thank you. I'll round up everyone in the square. But first, to call any nine. I mean, aren't you forgetting something? Guy who just died. Is apparently not there. Alright, well. I tried to send you off.
But I think I'm good on going into Colony 9 at this point. Commander Zeon appears to trust us, which is what should be happening right now. The main issue that I have with breaking Colony 9's flame block right now, though, is that that is going to push uh, Kvess's, uh, Kvess's alert level a lot higher than Agnes. Muses are quite striking. Do they really grow from a head? Tell I'm being watched. He must be very weary of me. Eh. Nah, he he's just fangirling over the years. All right, here we are. Let's go deal with this flame block. about this smell? Should we be worried? Also, I'm apparently going the wrong way. Uh, hmm. Okay, we're just gonna trigger the uh, the quest zone right here, apparently. Oh boy! Our heroes return. Yep. Where have you been? Just watching from the sidelines. And I must say, it was quite a spectacle. Huh? In what way? Bed pardon. I forget. You drones have no aesthetic sense. Your droll skirmish was one thing. It almost put me to sleep. But this here... Well, I'd say the colony is due a promotion. I recall no droll skirmish. The one where these maggots surfaced. Loads of little worms plotting together with Agnes, then deserting their duty like the cowards they are. Truly disgusting. A disgrace to the colony. And that goes for the ones who croaked for nothing, too. Even calling that droll is a disservice to the word. Croaked for nothing? I know you see us as enemies. But this, it's our friends you're talking about. Even Wamba. Back then, how dare you! Silence, maggots! He must still be tired from fighting. Rejoice then! You will give me great pleasure as I crush you. What do you think you're doing? The words of an idle man who orders others around. Or the words of rebels who risk their lives for us. Which do you think is worth more? Silence! This is insubordination. Looks like someone's made their choice.
Yeah, I think we're gonna need to deal with that with that flame claw before we can actually. Uh... Where did he? Don't you realize? Hello. The maggot that feasts on our dead. That would be you. There we go. We want to live. That is why we fight. Looks like we might be getting some support for this one. Console B. Why you? Good for nothing, you smash, I guess. This must be eradicated. Zion. Yes. Let's go. It looks like uh, they're just kind of standing there with their weapons drawn in the sidelines and doing nothing. Cool. Alright. Mm, do they want to really stand in front of them? I don't think they do. Fire and so is Zeon. Did he just chuck Uni against the edge of the uh, arena? <laughs> We got two healers and two tanks for this. Let's see how that goes. Chain up. So heroes. Ah, uh, that is a side. I think I might have hit the wrong button now. Uh, side attack. Two attacks in, bombshell blitz. Bombshell blitz and do, 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 bombshell blitz. I use my thinking muscles for this one. It's <laughs> such a great line. Alright, sure, let's try yours. Two more attacks, right into another one. 
Like, there is a chance that I'm not even going to make it to the end of the line. Like side attacking is still gonna be the thing to do. Wow. This one hundred percent in one hit. It does kind of remove the possibility of getting a grape though. Which is not ideal. But there it is. Full chain. And not everyone even got to uh got to act there. Gotta wait until intro then three before I uh Unleash that. Alright. Four boys, let's go. I mean, this is a pretty rough fight. You gotta kind of believe it there, Noah. Geez, I didn't realize that we only had four people in that. Uh, yeah, Mio's... Mio's down. I can't really explain why Lance and Senna aren't in this. That's kind of annoying. Oh man. Think of the break off. Cool. I feel like the concept of um, like the concept of the chain attack kind of uh, puts talking as a free action to a new level. Right? 
Doesn't really matter what we do. Oh, we got the break off at the very least. Took it to a daze. Yeah, I kind of see some similarities between the Ouroboros system and the movie Divergent. Because the whole point with Divergent is that um, everyone's got to pretty much fit into their little boxes of which um, which faction do they belong to? And I feel like up until now in our lives, uh, as Kevesi and Agnian troops, oh jeez, that ain't good. Ugh. Uh, I am not letting that one. That sucks. That really sucks. Free try a battle. Not much else we can do. Oh! So you're letting us actually redefine our party. There's a few of these guys that are up to rank 10. So let's go and do that. I'm going to make you a medic gunner. To make you a sword fighter, and then I'm gonna hit him again. <laughs> and I, I know that you're still rank nine, you're not quite to rank ten, but I kind of want to change you up for. Um, for a Zephyr. Eh, not yet. We got it this time, though. Are we going to make with me? There is the slight disadvantage that we're down to one turn. Come on, can I get some heals, please? Where are the heals? Can I please get some heals?
Oh, there are two healing circles here, thank you. Just gonna casually stand in both of these. can just enjoy it, that's fine. I'm gonna guess that in order for me to be able to um, in order for me to be able to give Arbolus orders, I'm going to have to like unlock them later on in the game. Off. Nope. Can we get it off this time? Sure can. I'm pretty sure that's Sai. Maybe it's not. Maybe that's the problem. So what's the threshold for great? Do I have to like make it like over 150% or something? I've only done it a couple of times. I feel like really felt it is a reference to I'm really feeling it. went down at the same time and also my tank. That's less than ideal. Ugh. Lens, you need to save the day, like right now.
Wow, okay. They'll set this right, huh? That went substantially worse than... Hmm. Not sure how much this is gonna help, because, uh... It's not like we're constantly using this. Found power in a newfound land. Get it, Newfoundland. Not enough SP. Huh, alright. Stuff down here is getting expensive. So what are these? You know what, maybe I want to save it up for a second. I don't know how much this is going to help. But if it can help at all. <laughs> Just realize his stats are caca. That is amazing. So what you got in here? Topple? Damage dealt by 70% when awakened. Knockback and also boost damage by 70%. That's a taunt. And that's a stance. Switch of this with this. I feel like it might be more important for this fight to have a taunt. Uh, so we have an ether uh, ether attack, one target with days, front word AoE with sleep. Healing and also. That might be more useful. as a healer so I think I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a solid stance with stormy skies here Attack with one target. Evasion down. Attack with frontward AoE sleep. 
I don't think we're going to be able to sleep this guy. Uh, physical attack, one target, time recharge. Nuclear attack, one target, you could have done that. Still attack on target and break. I don't like how, like, everyone only has one. Uh, talent art, except for like Noah. Let's go attack when I'm going to go down. I'd bleed to that. I'm targeted on auto attack recharge. Uh, and side attack. I could really use that third um, fusion art slot. Biffy. Not gonna lie. Also really neat that uh, you're able to select different uh, outfits without having to pick a class. So this time I'm gonna have um the party focus on using fusion arts. Damn. I might need a second tank for this. Like, that might be what I need to do here. Ion's down, Yumi's almost down, but they've gone ahead and interlinked. Oh, cool! You're doing this to me now.
Now I'll let Reigns and Senna here finish their intro link and uh Can I charge up the chain attack? I like I've seen it shining harder than that. So I'm thinking that it's actually possible to like build it up more. Break, topple, day, there we go. You know what? While you're dazed, let's go ahead and do this. That's probably going to be a problem with yeah. I'm not sure what the point limits are. I think it's like some types of uh, moves will hit point limit and some, ta some types of moves will uh, break instead. It doesn't really matter what I pick here because we're not going to get another one in. Um, go ahead and top everyone up here and finish up that chain attack. We're gonna make it one way or the other. This might take a few tries. Oh, 
Sun is fine. We're good. We're fine. Mia's dead. <laughs> so much for that. We're doing better than our last attempt. And actually, Interlink right now be the best thing. Of the days, all right. Yeah, unfortunately that overheated again. comes the laser again. Oh, we need to chain attack like now. I'm wondering if that's a, uh, if that's a hard and rage, actually. This ain't gonna do it, but uh, at the very least we can do some good with this. I'm guessing the threshold is 150. Oh, great. Doesn't really matter what I pick ultimately. Let's get some more heals in. It's best that I can do. You were just clearing your head, lying down on the ground in the middle of a battle. Sure, buddy. Console B is angry, shit goes down. Nope, we're not gonna get this one either. This battle is not a joke. All right, well, we are going to try it again.
But uh, I think, honestly, it's time for a little break. Because I need to kind of regroup and rethink how I'm going to do this. Uh, I might need to actually use some, some classes that are maxed out in order to um, make full use of the ranked up skills. Anyway. Uh, so yeah, that's going to be break time. So uh, y'all take a moment, uh, get a drink, go to the bathroom if you need to, stretch your arms, stretch your legs, stretch your teeth, and uh, when we come back, we'll continue our fight against Mobius B and uh, hopefully actually get him down in the next try. So I'll see you in a bit. <laughs> 